Police in Warren are searching for suspects involved in a smash and grab. This happened overnight at a gas station at Nine Mile and Ryan. It took less than five minutes for the suspects to get away with an ATM. 7 Action News reporter Nima Shafe has the latest. That door right behind me ripped off its hinges. Within a matter of minutes, the suspects taking the ATM. All of it getting caught on that camera right above the door. We are neighborhood station. I mean, I think uh, me and my... Uh Co-worker, they very friendly to the neighborhood. So friendly that this morning, those who frequent Ahmed Albatat's Marathon gas station here are wondering what happened overnight. We don't have no a problem with the neighborhood, and they've been helping us a lot. Around 2 this morning, vandals took advantage of the gas station, breaking through the front door and stealing the ATM inside. Just take a look at the surveillance video. You'll see it. The entire smash and grab taking less than five minutes. Ahmed tells me what he saw after the alarm company woke him up. I came to the store, the police was outside, and the door was laying down on the ground. And uh, find out they didn't take nothing except the ATM machine. And here's another look. The suspects had to try their broken chain three times before the ATM fell off the ground, ripping the bolts that anchor it down. And here, you see the suspects sliding the ATM out on the ground. Then this, the suspects loading it up at 2.04 this morning. And this isn't the first time Ahmed has been forced to call police. He's had two similar instances over the past three years. I mean, you know, when you open business or store or whatever, that's the consequences. I mean, we already knew that. This part of the business. Around any problem, I mean, you know, when anybody tries to start the dramas in the store, they call the police right away. And that's what he's hoping you do if you were in the area last night around 2 in the morning and saw anything. Call Warren Police. And we have late information that that ATM that those suspects you saw in that video stole may have been empty. We're in Warren. I'm Nima Shafe, 7 Action News. Nima, thank you.